All right. All right, this is going to be a quick video showing off the logic on the hoverboard mechanic, getting on and off of it. All right. So, quickly, all you need on the hoverboard is, oops, again, this isn't my hoverboard. This was something I found. All right, so in the controller logic, you want to go over to the imp, make it remote controllable. All right. Oops. Why did I do that? Yeah, remote, remote controllable. And um, to make this stay up right a little bit, I put this little gyroscope on it that's not actually on it. And I did these numbers. All right. Um, that's pretty much it for that. The board, the actual board, you can scope in quickly and um, tag it as machine. Unclick all this. And again, you can tag it wherever you want. Uh, put a, I just deleted that for a sec. Put a uh, tag right here, similar to that. All right, <clears throat> so that's basically it for the, now on the puppet, all we need here is, we're gonna use square, so when we, press square and we're in the detected zone we can uh, all right I put it as label so when it finds the label machine it will be detected again and then a signal manipulator here all right your signal manipulator is custom mapper toggle on and off so this will again let you toggle on and off um, so when you hit it once, it'll go on. Again, the same button, off the next time. All right. All right. And after that, you're going to want a teleporter. All right. I named this hoverboard match target orientation and match target orientation and match position. All right. <clears throat> and then the same thing. Now, this is the biggest part of all this. All right. So before I do the... um. I put a, again, let's see, gadget, uh, whatever it is, text displayer down, and then just plug that into the play, type in whatever you want. Um, all right, so basically, this is where mostly everything is in this keyframe. So the keyframe is, literally one um one pose right so that's the pose right so when so when you hit the button he'll go into this pose and he will teleport to the um board so wherever this tag is that we call hoverboard i basically snapped it to the board it will snap it to um because you have this typed in here, hoverboard, it will, right when you are in the trigger zone, you hit square, it will teleport you right to the hoverboard. And just use the tag to kind of, um, you know, wherever you put this tag, however you position this, if I go into play, he'll get in that position right and of course you don't want him in that position so you just mess around with it and get him in the right position all right so that's basically it except for this so this what you want is when you hit square you're gonna want to go into the puppet so when this is when you have this on record Again, you want to make your keyframe this, you know, whatever pose you want them in. But you also want to click off movable and check off glidable. All right. And you want to check this off also. Turn this off. You want to, oh, and you want to check, there's a few other things. You want to turn this off. And again, while this is, this keyframe is still playing, we actually one more thing we want to do in there. Oh 
don't know actually. We want to turn, I don't know, hit L1 square. You want to turn this on. So this, if I didn't mention it first, you want this powered off in the beginning. All right. So when this keyframe goes on, it's going to power this on. So you're going to teleport. It's going to shut off this um, text displayer. It's going to turn off your collider and your uh, movable on your puppet not the actual sculpt or anything like that but the actual puppet logic uh, and you're going to turn this on when you get on it and then this signal player is going to turn everything off when you hit the square button again all right so let's show that off uh, so when i get close to it There you go. Pretty good. And one last quick little thing. If you mess around with this signal manipulator on and off, again, you don't really need to do this. This It's fine if it snaps. I think he still snaps to it, to be honest. Yeah, he'll, it takes him, it'll slowly get on it, kind of. But I guess it doesn't really matter to have that. Um, I'd rather just keep it to zero. All right, so that's really it, man. Uh, hopefully this was um, of, you know, it's helped you and this is what you wanted. And again, oh, you want this detected to this. Yeah. And that's it. Uh, it's pretty quick. Uh, it's simple. And it works. So again, let me know what you think. And uh, yeah, hopefully it's good. And hopefully this could help anyone else. So um, just let me know if I uh, if I explained it fine. So again, yeah. Just make sure this is uh, this starts out as off. Power this off and remote controllable. All right. All right, guys, that is it, and I will see you in the next one. Peace.